Good day guys, Bing here. Um, so yesterday we tried this exercise. Um, we used, uh, we created one adaptive family and then placed it into a pattern, pattern based um, uh, family and then apply onto this uh, divider surface. Okay, so this is what we did uh, yesterday. So today we're going to quickly uh, uh, try try um, Dynamo and randomize this pattern. Okay, so but before that, um, let me just quickly, uh, uh, I'll just quickly uh, adjust a setting, um, show edge, ch um, turn off the smooth line, and also turn off the shadow. So, okay, so, um, First, we need to change this back to uh, the original uh, uh, divided surface, um, a rectangle, rect uh, rectangle one. And also, I just turn off, uh, turn on the surface, turn on the pattern, and also I want to turn on the nodes. So this is um, not enough. So this uh, the grids are too big. So we're going going to increase this. So let's try thirty five. Okay, so this is the surface pattern we're going to use today. So, um, okay, instead of you know trying to use the pattern based family, so we're going to just place uh, place uh, the adaptive family directly onto this. Okay, so so let's just do it. One, two, three, four. Okay, so once we placed one, and we can select it and repeat. So this will apply that this adaptive family to the whole divided surface. And we can see some of the, these panels not on the same size, same side. So um, let's see if we can fix this. So let's have a look, Se tab select one of them, edit family. So I'm going to just try to change the, um, select all these adaptive points. And let's try try let's try host. Load this back. Override. Okay, so I think that's yeah, that's better. Uh hell. Um that's better, but there's still one you can see this uh the panel here is supposed to be on the other side. So maybe we should just go back here. I think um, we should probably change the point uh, here. So tab, tab, we're trying to pick the point on which we place this point. Okay, so this one currently, uh, maybe we just try to um, rotate it by 180 degree. So let's try this, okay? so And also 180 degree. So let's try this override. And hopefully, yeah. So now this, now this is perfect. Okay, so this is perfect. And then, um, okay. So now what we need to do is this is a repeater. Huh? So which means if you try to select one and change this, so this will change the whole, uh, so change all these family. So we need to remove. So once we remove the repeater, we can change them individually. Okay, so now we are going to create a Dynamo script to randomize the uh, parameter. Okay, so now let's do it. New. So this will be very, I think it's, it, will be, it will be very simple. Just go to Revit selection. So first, let's change this to manual. And, and then we're going to use family type. Okay, and then for that family too all element of family type link this so if i click on run so this will give us a list of this family so 175 and then right click set parameter by name okay so link this element element and name will be uh, n okay so link this to parameter name the value so we need to create a list uh, I'm going to use 0 0.01 to 0.49 every uh, 0 0.01 so this will give if I click on run so this will give us a list so you can see this is a list 
forty nine. So to cover that, um, to cover this uh, list of family, we need uh, time this by four. So let's cycle it. Um, okay, so four and link to the amount. So this will give us uh, one hundred ninety six, and then we just need to use the shuffle. So we're going to use a shuffle with seed. Okay, let's, let's see it. Let's see it. the seed. The seed we're going to use inter integer slider. Okay. Oh, where is it? Here. So link it to this. So now we can just link uh, connect this to this. So if I click run, so just need to wait for a few seconds, and Revit is uh, trying to randomize all these panels. Okay. So now we have this. Um, but I think the issue we have here is because previously we have the panels, you know, so all the vertical panels um, having the same parameter, which means it will, so it they, um, it will, looks like uh, continuous. But this one, because they 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 have different uh, numbers of whatever. This one's uh, zero point four. This one's zero point two two. So uh, in order to match. Um, to uh, have, so, sorry, we just need to to have the same uh, parameters for all those panels on the same uh, vertical line. So, um, I think so. So this is something we're looking for. Is actually, this. So I think this um, probably won't work because this will just change, randomize all the panels. Um, so I think. Uh, let me think. So how should we do this? Okay, so um, maybe we, we can we can do this. So I'm going to delete all these. Okay, so to delete the top, and then we can just randomize all these. So just so uh, let me just uh, change this one to automatic. So and then I'll just. It will automatically change. So if I change this, so you will see it will automatically change. So once I'm happy with the the pattern, so I just uh, pick, try to pick. Uh, not sure about this. Um, okay, so let's say um, this one's quite okay, and then we can just, uh, just let me just change this back to manual. Just be careful because if you do not change this to um, to manual so um, if you add more of these panels it will automatically uh, adjust every time you have new panels so now we can select all these um, let's filter out the reference line and then we should be able to just click on repeat and this will create so you can see or, or create same and then this is it so you can see it's all these every single you know vertical line they are all the same 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 um, parameter and um, and also horizontal um, they are all different right okay so yeah I think that's it so it's it's quite similar uh, the, um, to the the one we did yesterday, but uh, but uh, we didn't use pat, uh, pat, pattern based family in this. So um, yeah. Oh, sorry, and, and also apologize. I forgot to upload the, the family. Um, I think I will just upload. Maybe I'll just upload both. So this one and the one. Uh, from yesterday so yes that's it so very simple exercise today so with uh, dynamo so this is the script it's very simple and if you have any questions please let me know and I'll see you next time thank you bye